we have a new invest area out here in the western pacific located towards the southeast of the philippines this is located actually right around palau right now now invest 98w and uh, over the past 24 hours since my last video update have seen some slight organization even for that matter on infrared satellite imagery there actually is a bit of a low level circulation visible here you can see it right here with all this convection flaring up uh, across palau over towards Yap, and then you can kind of see it wrapping into right here. Now, there is plenty of dry air on the western periphery of it, but with a low level center, it does indicate that maybe this might get a little more organized. And as we know from storm after storm after storm, they enter the Philippine Sea, things do tend to organize quickly. This is the ASCAT imagery, by the way. You have Guam and Saipan right there. And towards the southwest, there's Yap, by the way. Um, you do have a little bit of that southwesterly or southerly flow, which would indicate Kate. Uh, counterclockwise rotation thus putting an area of low pressure kind of right in here uh, just kind of uh, some data to infer the possibility of this low level center really organizing do something a bit more take a look at the bigger view and the upper levels this is your upper level winds in the blue about one to 200 millibars in the green about three to 500 millibars and you have your low pressure system right in here low level winds kind of indicating but aloft you do have that outflow coming in here and kind of a little bit of an upper level trough right in there which is going going to help a little bit of that exhaust for this to continue developing kind of a uh, blow up and really just give that a uh, chimney effect for this to start to spin up so you have a few factors coming into play here why uh, today when I take a look at the GFS model it does indicate uh, kind of what we're talking about here with that low pressure area spinning up moving across Visayas or Southern Luzon uh, possibly as a tropical depression you know maybe even could be close to tropical storm as we go ahead in the Thursday and the Friday I'm not going to put a name on that just yet but overall i mean you kind of have this area in here of possible uh tropical nature weather i mean it's the philippines it's june of course duh but the thing to note here is that uh once you have that take place look at some of these rain totals that could be picked up here based on the gfs uh euro actually putting out very similar totals as well upwards of three to four hundred millimeters and that's enough to cause some localized flooding i mean of course it is the dry season form of rainfall definitely welcome this by the way the ecmwf just showing you some of these rain totals expected as this kind of develops not as potent as the gfs but still showing something in that area so plenty of time not actually plenty of time to watch it we got a few days to watch this i should say uh big thing right now i don't expect the typhoon granted i have been bitten the butt before by systems like this that i didn't expect anything then they developed into something more but at least for now i i would say maybe a tropical depression coming out of this i mean some neat Needed rainfall if you are out here in the philippines just keep that in mind watch out for maybe some localized flooding later on this week heading into the weekend especially across uh, much of central and southern luzon maybe even northern areas of Asai. something to watch out for by the way the rainy season front for the uh southern japanese islands just been potent out here i mean you're not getting a break actually record-breaking rainfall as of late uh just one storm after another i mean goodness gracious go back to that precipitation with the gfs <laughs> this just indicates across parts of kyushu uh, very similar rain totals this is not tropical related it's seasonal rainy season front just continuing to uh impact that area anyways if you guys have any questions comments or suggestions please let me know down in the comment box below always appreciate that feedback and yeah thanks for watching i should have another update out on this soon we're going to continue to watch this invest area